Hello everybody out here on YouTube. It is I here from Beautiful Beauty. Going to be doing a product review. Going to be talking about uh, teeth, oral hygiene, dental care, uh, mouthwash, all that good fun stuff. Okay, so, um, and, and I say fun stuff because I love, I love, you guys know if you've watched my product reviews, I love, not only do I love mouthwashes, I love toothpaste, I love dental care, I love gadgetry that has to do with teeth. Um, electric toothbrushes, my Oral-B electric toothbrushes, my Sonicare, uh, my Radius manual toothbrushes, all that stuff. So I really get very excited over anything dental related. Okay, now I'm very particular about my mouthwashes as well. I prefer them to be things like alcohol-free, possibly even unflavored, uh, unscented, unflavored, alcohol-free, and free of harsh chemicals because that really dries my mouth out. I have very sensitive teeth, I have sensitive gums. And if I use the wrong type of mouthwash, it totally dries my mouth out. Um, it can even make my gums and my teeth more sensitive. It's just not a good feeling. So I come across this about a month ago and you know, I think I've seen it before, but nah, you know what I mean? It's just one of those things I think I've seen before, but I've never actually used it. Okay, and I don't know, I don't know how to say this, but Cloesis, closis. I don't, I don't know, guys, how to see that. But anyhow, you can see, you can see it. Anyhow, it says it's alcohol-free oral health care, oral health rinse. Okay. Now, if you do want to flavor this, however, it came with this really tiny bottle of drops here, which are very tiny and microscopic. But anyhow, these are flavoring drops. So if you want to flavor up your mouthwash use the flavoring drops. I honestly have not used the flavoring drops yet because like I said, I prefer just unflavored, unscented, more bland. That's good with me. I'm cool. You know what I mean? So I've been using this mouthwash for about a month and I really like it. I don't get any um, dryness in the mouth. I don't get irritated gums. Uh, my teeth are no more sensitive, you know, than they ever were. I'm not getting a negative reaction from this product. So anything that I don't get a negative reaction from and I feel that works is a go, you know? So I like to always use my mouthwash first. A lot of people will use the mouthwash um, after they brush their teeth. I just like to use mine first. It's just, it works better for me. I like to uh, swish it around, gargle it around, play with my mouthwash first and then brush my teeth as the second step. So I like to use it first. And what I feel it does, especially with this product so far, when I use it first, it just, um, it, it lo loosens up the things that stuck to my teeth. You know, it feels like it, it loosens food particles. If food particles are stuck between your teeth, it feels like it'll loosen up a uh, tartar, it'll loosen up plaque. It just feels to me like it loosens up the gunk that's on your teeth and in your mouth and even on your tongue. It loosens the gunk up. And um, then I go in afterwards and then I brush my teeth and then I will follow up with um, scrubbing my tongue with a tongue scrubber. You know, it's, it's, I'll always take multiple steps. It's mouthwash, uh, brushing my teeth, following it up by tongue scrubber, scrubber, <laughs> scrubber, tongue scrubber or scraper, either, you know, last, that's my last step. I have a lot of tongue scrubbers and I have a lot of, lot of tongue scrubbers and I'm getting tongue twisted saying that. So I got this at Walmart and I, you know, I believe it was like, I don't remember exactly. It's a month ago. It was anywhere between 12 and $19. But anyhow, we'll link it up in the down bar below. I believe it might've been 12 something dollars. Yeah, like $13 or something. So it says right here that it is non-irritating for sensitive mouth, unflavored. Uh, it says with flavor control and like I said, here it comes with these drops to flavor it up if you'd like to. I have yet to do that because I, I don't, you know, you know what I mean? Anyhow, it says it's uh, non-burning, it's alcohol-free. That is very true. It is very mild. It is totally non-irritating. I love that. Let's see what else I can tell you about it real quick here. Okay, so it's not only it's alcohol-free. Look, it's, uh, it's gluten-free, sulfate-free, uh, tricycline-free, which that's good, alcohol-free, it's free of yucky stuff. And let me see if I can find. Okay, it just talks about if you want to flavor it up with the little flavoring drops, you can. It tells you how to do that. And. T 
trying to find the ingredients for you guys here because I know I'm always interested in ingredients and I talk about ingredients. Okay, you think it's on the back of the box somewhere? Where are you? Okay, maybe it's actually on the back of the bottle itself. Oh yeah, this is a really large size bottle. It is, let me find the ounces. It is 32 fluid ounces. So it's a really nice size bottle. I mean, it'll probably last me a really long time. It really will. So I've been using it about a month and it's really full. Let's see if we can come up with ingredients. Mm-hmm. <laughs> That's the downfall, you guys, of having the windows open when you're making videos. Okay. Speeding cars. What can I say? Okay. Um, yeah. Let's see if I can find the ingredients. I keep saying that. Repeat, repeat, repeat. And where are you, ingredient list? I am not able to find the ingredients on this product. Okay. And you guys know how I love to look at the ingredient list. Mm -hmm. Okay, well, there we go. Okay, guys. It says it contains water. Okay. Stabilized chlorine dioxide. There's sodium phosphate, a citric acid. Very, 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 very limited on the ingredients list, which if you ask me, that's not a bad thing. I prefer my products to have less ingredients, less chemicals, the less the better, less is best, you know what I mean? Works really great for sensitive gum, works really great for sensitive teeth, um, all that stuff. Um, I even have a lot of jaw problems and uh, TMJ trouble and things like that, you know? So. Funny thing is, um, you know, if you have any type of jaw problems or teeth grinding or bruxism, TMJ issues, things like that, it really makes a difference, the products you use. Okay, guys, much love. Take care. Be sure to give me a big, huge thumbs up. Be sure to give me a big, huge like. As always, like, share, and subscribe. Bye, beauties.